Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to animate words or letters. So there's two ways that you can animate text, or actually there's multiple ways, but if we wanted to have uh, a sentence show up in a PowerPoint with just having the words show up one by one, or have the letters show up one by one, there's actually a pretty simple way to do that. So what, do we, what am I talking about? Well, for the example, let's say for example we just want to have words appear one by one in this example. So the second example is actually having the letters appear one by one. So this might take a little bit longer, so probably better for shorter sentences, but you can also do this. So let me show you how this could be done. So here I am in a new slide. So let's say, for example, let me put some text here. This will be the word by word one. So I'll just go ahead and make them all caps. Word by word. And my next one would be uh, letter by uh, letter. Right. So let's go ahead and select this range of words, go under the Animations tab, and uh, we can set a couple different animations. I usually just like to use a pair. And so after we selected a pair, you'll notice that there's a number one here indicating that there's an animation for this now. And so what we need to do is we need to modify that. And so what we can do is go under the Animation pane, we're under Animations, go to the Animation pane, and under the animation pane, we have our first animation here. And by default, it uh, starts on a click, and that's fine. So what we want to do is click the drop down and go under the effect options. And under the effect options, this is where we can edit it. And so what we want to do is we want to have this particular uh, animate text drop down selected word by word. So if it goes by a word, uh, we can also time the delay between the words. Usually if you put it at zero, all the things will show up at once. So uh, I usually just accept the defaults. So once I click OK, and if we go ahead, it, it will preview for it. Let me, that was a little bit quick, so let me go ahead and just play it again. And you can see that it has played it word by word. Now letter by letter, it's basically the same thing. You can go ahead and select that, um, go under and click on that animation, you'll now notice that there is a number two there. That is going to be the second animation. It also defaults by on click. You can change that if you wanted to have it go with previous or after previous, basically with the previous animation or after it. And I need to go ahead and select this and have the effect options change too. And this can be uh, letter by letter. So once I click OK, it will preview it for me. And you can see that it is going by pretty slowly. Maybe I didn't want letter by letter to be so slow. I can make it a little bit faster. As I said before, you may not want to have it down to 0, but maybe close to 0. Maybe I'll have this close to 0, maybe at point 2. And then click OK. And we'll go ahead. Well, let's then preview. So let's go ahead and preview this again. And you can see that it's been a little bit, it's a little bit faster. And so it's probably better for sentences that are not too long. But if it's a word-by-word -word animation, you can probably have a little bit lo lo little longer sentences. Um, so that is how we can animate uh, words or letters as they appear on screen, either word-by-word -word or letter-by-letter. I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.